Hello friends. Today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different than normal. This video is going to be mainly for the pro lawn care guys out there. We're going to be talking about nitrogen and nitrogen offerings. And for all of you DIYers out there, this might just be some fun information for you to take a look at and, and absorb and digest and, and maybe learn a little bit more about. So let's jump right into it. This may come as a surprise to some of the DIYers out there, but at Green County Fertilizer, the biggest, highest volume material that we go through is nitrogen. And we've offered a couple of different options of that uh, over the last many, many years uh, in our 28% in charge and our 26% that some of you are out there using now. But we've added and expanded that line and it's important to get it out there so that people can kind of see what else we are doing at the plant down there in Georgia. So there's three things really to cover off and, and talk about the high points of each of these so everybody gets a good idea and perspective about liquid uh, nitrogen fertilizer and what it can do for you. So we're gonna kind of do a, a top-down sort of situation here. The 28% nitrogen that we've been offering for a number of years is stabilized with NBPT. The main function of that stabilization is to slow down uh, the urea from volatilization. And you can get typically between six and eight weeks of feeding out of that material, out of the 28% in charge. But for the most part, you're dealing with a soluble fertilizer that's ready to be uptaken by the grass and you're gonna get a nice response. But that, that's about the limit. Now we've pretty much kept that as our standard offering for the lawn care industry, mainly because it's very budget friendly and getting six to eight weeks of color, that's pretty standard to hit between rounds and you can last that long without a whole lot of difficulty. Now, some of the risks or some of the issues that could happen out there is people who are using low volume ride-on equipment, it may not be the best solution because there is uh, some potential for burn if you don't have enough water carrier. Now, this year we did a modification that we're calling the Gateway Green, which is also a 28% material, but it's stabilized with NBPT as well as DCD and we have some fulvic acid in that one. Uh, just a couple little changes to make that one a bit more robust, as it were. The Gateway Green is even more affordable than the regular in-charge, and it's, again, something that's going to get you six to eight weeks of color, soluble fertilizer, soluble nitrogen, that's going to really give a nice color pop to the turf. So you have a nice stabilized nitrogen with a couple little additives that are gonna help with rooting and stress and things of that nature just a nice value add nitrogen piece and that is new for the 2024 season. The third nitrogen that we're offering this year which is unique to any other season that we've done this is our 2800 triazone which is a 72 percent slow release. Now the cool thing about the triazone is if you're just using it on its own just as it stands you have a material that can last up to 90 days. The first phase of its release is going to be what you would expect out of just a soluble urea fertilizer. You're gonna get a nice growth in color and then this long feeding that really extends out. Now that can change with moisture and that can change with heat. It's all relative to the microbes breaking that down. But when you're talking about a, a, a slow release liquid, this is like a three and three kind of chain to really form a nice tight bond so that this material just takes a long time to feed out. Now, the cool thing about the triazone that we have as this whole package here is we can blend that to any level of slow release with any of our other options. So you're able to take and pick and pull between these other, the Gateway Green or the InCharge 28 or 26 and really anything in our catalog and blend it with this triazone. It is remarkably stable material. And depending on where you are in the country, if you have to have a 50% slow release that goes out, if you have to have a percentage of slow release, or if you're on a ride-on low volume machine, you've got something now you can put out without the risk of burn. So it really opens up the door for you to have these late spring fertilizer applications that will feed through the summertime and you can really up your nitrogen rates with that material. To expand on what I mentioned earlier about mixing the different items together, we have gone to the moon and back with what we can do as far as concentrations of our standard catalog materials mixing into the triazone and having stability. It is absolutely remarkable. So you can truly dream up your own custom blend and we can do it in totes and get it to you very simply. So that's something that I would 
want everybody to take a look out, my pros out there, to just say, hey, you know, what would be great is if I could do a microgreen and this TZ, that would be phenomenal, or, or can I do this, that, or the other. The only caveat to this whole thing is it doesn't do well with iron. So like the 700, not a great option to do, but the microgreen, absolutely. So you have some ability to kind of pick and choose with that material and what you want it mixed with. Now, if you want to talk awesome stability, we've mixed up to 50-50 with our straight humic and have no issues with that and have a complete solution. It's going to be something that you guys will love to play with as we go forward here. And again, because of its stability, and your ability to go with lower volumes of water and increase your rates of in, it can be an excellent replacement for any other granular fur you might be out there pounding the ground with. In the description down below, there are links to these on our website. I want you guys to take a look at and feel free to reach out for more information. For you DIYers who, who are out there, if this is something that you're interested in, please feel free to reach out. It's something we can talk to our vendors about if they wanna carry this material, um, this true slow release liquid in their catalog. But as of right now, we're, we're not offering that out. It would be up to you guys. It would be up to the viewer to demand that in a way, uh, to create a market to see that that would be a good option. Currently in the DIY market, there's plenty of that available if you start looking at labels and seeing these different percentages of slow release, but it is very expensive material when I see it packaged down. So we would wanna make sure that we provide a great value to everybody out there when this happens to have it make sense uh, for you to use a nitrogen source like that. But I, I'll tell you what, the difference is phenomenal. It is remarkably beautiful and clean material that your grass just looks amazing after application. It gives kind of a shine to everything and uh, mixing with other chemicals and different things like that. It works well as if it were its own adjuvant. Um, it's, it's phenomenal material. So, you know, feel free to comment on that. Uh, you know, let me know if this is something that you guys think would be of interest for you out in the marketplace. But for your pros, reach out. Uh, you have contacts to the reps that you're dealing with already. You know, we can get this priced and moving to you guys really quickly. It's been something that's moving at extremely high volume to some of our larger clientele for the last while. And I just wanna make sure that everybody out there has some additional details and info. And if you haven't signed up on the pro side for our Green County newsletter, reach out to me so that you can make sure that you're in the loop about all these new products that we've been releasing and what's coming in the future. There is a lot going on right now and I just wanna make sure everybody is up to speed on that. Thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to y'all real soon. See ya.